women are twice as likely to be diagnosed with anxiety. Hi, I'm Teresa Weatherspoon, and today we'll be talking about mindfulness and meditation. I played in the W for eight years. Teresa Weatherspoon at the buzzer of three. Oh, she put it in. Had an opportunity to coach on the NBA side with the Pelicans, and just basketball has been a part of my life for a tremendous amount of years. Well, before, most people were afraid to speak about how they felt for having certain situations or not being able to handle things. But today, it has been known as a very serious situation, and people take it serious about how people feel. I think it's a difficult piece because it happens on both ends of the spectrum. With women, there's a lot of things that we hold inside. But for us to always understand, it doesn't matter your gender, we're gonna go through some things. It's important for them to at least try to find a friend, a family member that you truly trust. It could be a coach, it could be a teacher, or someone you feel like truly has your best interest at heart. And then pour out everything that you feel. So then someone can understand how to be able to talk to you. But it's also important that who you're talking to truly understands the direction that you wanna go. It doesn't matter who that person might be, but it's up to you to know that you trust them because only then will you release what you feel. Everybody knows the story is out there, but with Zion, it was a trust issue. He trusted me. But for me at that point, I just wanted to just hold him. I just wanted to let him know that he was okay and that he had someone in his corner. You don't have to have all the words, just have few words. I start my day in prayer. I'm thankful to have another opportunity to do what life is. And I ask for peace and I ask for joy. Goal set is every day. I wanna find something that I can master every single day. What are you getting better with? Rewire yourself and getting yourself back to that mindful place of who you are, where you're going, and how the mission looks. It's about that deep breathing every single day and pushing all the negative things out and pulling back in the positive. Be mindful of where you are, be mindful of who you are, but then as you pour back into yourself, then you move into the positive direction that you wanna go. I would love to be in the Philippines because I would love to look at every young lady to let them know that this sport is built for you too. You're gifted, you're talented, and you deserve to play this sport. Everybody's gonna look at you, see you as female playing a sport, but we want you to be looked at as an elite athlete, period. Everybody's light is gonna dim sometimes, but as you carry your torch, this torch is only meant for you because this torch tells you everything that you've been through in life. But when you reach someone whose light is dim, light them up a little bit. Be impactful in someone else's life, not impressive, but impactful.